Welcome back everyone to Data Science for Everyone. Today we're going to be looking at plotting categorical variables with matplotlib. Let's get started. So first off, let's, uh, let me actually maybe clear up the taskbar a little bit. Um, so let's go on and get our basic import in. So let's do import um, matplotlib.pyplot as plt. And I, you know what, I don't think we're really gonna need anything else today. We're gonna just do some um, very basic examples. So first off, let's go on and maybe create up some data. And let's say that um, we want in here, um, <clears throat> let's say maybe you have uh, four employees. So let's say Dan, uh, and he has, let's say, uh, 10 referrals okay uh you have uh um carrie and she has uh maybe 15 referrals and you have uh bob who has uh only two referrals and uh libby uh who has um four referrals Okay, and uh, let's say that we have in here, um, we want to actually take out our names here. All right, so we have names is going to be equal to a list of our data dot keys. You know, I don't even think we actually need, we're gonna test this out here. I don't think we need this. Uh, and then let's do uh, values here. And that'll be data dot values. Okay, and let's go on and create up our uh, plots. Now we're going to do uh, three subplots here. <coughs> we'll do a bar chart, a scatter plot, and a line plot. Okay, so let's go on and take a look. So we'll do fig axis here plt dot subplots. Uh, we want a one row by three column. Uh, fig size here will be uh, maybe a 10 by 5 uh, and will they share they will also share the y-axis okay and we'll set that to true so then <coughs> axis 0 is uh, dot bar is going to be names values then we'll have x axis uh, one uh, which will be a scatter and that's names values then we'll do axis two uh, which will be just a plot of names and values okay and then let's go on and do something like um, fig dot um, uh, supplemental title okay and it'll be a uh, uh, categorical variables example oh, and I actually want to do that and so now we see here that we have three nice plots we have a bar plot a uh, <coughs> a scatter plot and a line plot all of these are using um, categorical variables and it's just a nice example to be able to do all three to kind of compare and you can definitely see that if you're wanting to compare and kind of discuss uh, data with people and everything it's definitely better to probably use this bar chart here because it's very human readable uh, and the next example we'll look at maybe doing um, uh, comparing two different uh, types of axes Okay, um, so if you guys like this, please comment, subscribe, and hit that like button, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.